Hello, my name is Ardi and we are going to solve problem 2.32 from Sadiku book. So the question is find I1 through I4 in the circuit of figure 2.96. And this is the figure and let's just define, dive in into it. Uh, I want to set this node here as our ground and maybe name this node here as node A. I think there is no other node here. So we can apply KCL at node A. So KCL at not A. KCL said that the sum of the current that goes in will equal to the current that goes out. There is no current that goes in in this node. All the current is going out. So I just put zero there. And let's analyze all the current that goes out. For I1, I will have VA minus zero divided by 50 so i'll have va over 50 this is for i1 and for i2 i will have va minus 0 which is also va divided by 200 and for i3 i will have va minus 0 divided by 40 so i'll have va over 40 and here i will have va divided by 16 Va divided by 60. 60. And this current that goes out here is also 16. So we'll have plus 16 there. Let's move that 16 to the left hand side. So I will have minus 16 is equal to all that fraction there. So I have minus 16 here. Okay. Mm, and I just want to use this one. Minus 16 is equal to VA. Then multiplied by 1 over 50. Plus 1 over 200. Plus 1 over 40. Plus 1 over 60. And so we can calculate VA. We can calculate VA. And that means that VA is minus 16 divided by all of that fraction. 1 over 50 plus 1 over 200 plus 1 over 40 plus 1 over 60. I don't want any complicated calculation. So let's just put that into calculator. So I'll have minus sign here and VA no, no VA. So this one will be 16 and divided by 1 over 40 and then plus 1 over 200 and then plus 1 over 40 and then plus 1 over 60. 1 over 60. So I will have minus 240. And the unit will be default, but the question is not asked about VA. The question is asked about I1, I2, I3, and I4, but this can be easily calculated. So I will have I1 is VA divided by 40. VA divided by 40, so I will have minus 240 divided by 50 and that means that I will have minus 4.8 ampere that is for I1 and for I2 similarly I will have VA but this time divided by 200 and so I will have minus 240 divided by 200 or that will equal to minus 1.8 2 ampere and for I3 I will have VA divided by 40 minus 240 divided by 40 that should be minus 6 ampere and lastly I will have I4 that will be VA divided by 60 so I will have minus 240 divided by 60 and that should be minus 4. 
and I think we have solved the problem. So we have I1, I2, I3, and I4. Hopefully this helped you and I did not make any mistakes. Let me know if I did make uh, mistakes in the comments and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.